that one thing. Um, one other advantage of picking them up by the, the skin of their backs is that it's a lot easier Sorry. to um, get them out of tight spaces. So, for example, this cage is an indoor cage um, that I'm using because I'm short. Uh, but the problem is, a, a cage like that, if I try to pick her up, she's going to get her, her paws caught on the wires. Yeah. And she's not going to be happy about it. So, going by the back, I can just go like this. Now, that's Eva. Eva. So Eva. cute. Eva, best bunny. Not the best. She's scratching. She's the first. Yeah. So she's the best. Okay. Mm. But yeah, going from the skin of the back, I can easily put her back too. By going like this, I can insert the butt and then go in. Now, because I was doing sl it slow, it didn't go as well. But I can do it as much as I want. Now, if I try to put her back in, I can let her do it by herself. Yeah, not always working. Yeah. She'll go. She just needs a minute. Ta-da. But to get her out, it's not going to work. Like, I'm going to try to bring her out like this. See? I was able to do it, but it was much harder um, than if I do go like this. Because when you pick them up, no, normally they have a tendency to bring their paws close to their body. Not all the time. But normally, so that helps getting them through tight spaces. Um, that's the only thing I forgot to say, I think. So, bye bye.